Uh, welcome to VLSA lab. This is um, Cadence tutorial first part. Let's start my computer, file system, application, EE VLSA lab Cadence. Double click on Virtuoso, running terminal. Uh, wait for some time. Okay, let me minimize this windows. Fine. Okay, then go to tools, library manager. Mm. Okay, this is the library manager. Start a new library. File new library. Mm. Cadence. tutorial one okay here it is mm. then we have to attach this to some technology library uh, attached to an existing technology library okay mm, we are using UMC 18 CMOS press ok as see here design library current successfully attached to library that's fine now file new cell view it's behind the screen uh, let's design a resistive divider or our div type schematic okay uh, this is the schematic editor here we can uh, draw our schematics and draw our circuit and we can simulate uh, first we have to <coughs> make uh, insert the components so go create instance this is the add instance browse this is the library we got we can use analog library for a capacitor analog library is basically ideal provides all the ideal components so the capacitor and the resistor type devices components you can take from this library type R E S yeah, resistor here select symbol ok this is 1 kilo ohm ok let's place it this one way to uh, create instance that is create instance the other method is you can go directly here create instance same thing but the better way you can just uh, use the shortcut key i small i small letter i you can see instance small letter i ok then right click to rotate the component right click right click right click place it press escape again create instance analog library we need a power supply and ground put ground first close ground symbol ok ok <coughs> again add instance browse we need a DC voltage source VDC it's there close uh, let's put 1 volt hide yeah now we have to wire up all the these devices you can go to create wire or you can se select this one create wire or you, or you can just plus press W it's a shortcut click join join yeah the circuit is now ready to simulate before simulate we have to check and save you can go file check and save or this way or you can just press X shortcut is X 
small letter x to simulate the circuit oh press escape fine to simulate go to launch ADE ADE means um, analog design environment ADE uh, let's pause a moment and just see what is there in ADE we got setup analysis variable output simulation result tools lot of things uh, first set of our analysis choose uh, we can have transient analysis or DC or frequency response AC noise and all now we just do a simple transient analysis for one second stop time one second enable ok or we can just press go here and press this one Trans we can uh, choose the analysis in this way also fine then we have to <coughs> select our input Mm, uh, before selecting the input, uh, it's be better to label the wires. Go here, create wire name, or just shortcut is small letter L. Press L, name, in height, place here, out hide place it check and save ADE here we can select our setup output or you can go here also output to be plotted select on schematic input output here you see what we selected is coming here and we tick to plot and now we are ready to simulate uh, for the simulation we can go here and then press netlist and run or we can just press this button netlist and run run it's running yeah this is the output what we expected it is the in the red line is input this is output this is the graphical output window you can press here and make it to two separate windows showing input showing output this is what we expect from a resistive divider and that's the, sim this is the end of our tutorial one thank you